Thank you for joining us on this trip to the ancient Mayan city of Koba. Koba is located approximately 27 miles northwest of Tulum, or about 43 kilometers. Visiting Koba is unlike a lot of other Mayan ruins. The grounds cover a very large area, so you most likely will want to rent a bike or take one of the pedicabs that are offered. It's fairly inexpensive to rent the bike. They're not the most comfortable bikes in the world, but they definitely do. The pedicabs are probably the easiest experience as they, uh, you're hiring a driver to uh, drive you around. The pedicabs will fit comfortably two riders. Be sure to tip your pedicab drivers. They're the ones exerting all the effort to get you to the uh, pyramid. You can walk as you can see several people walking along this trail, but just be warned, it is a really, really long walk, um, but not impossible. Along the path to the pyramid, you're going to find several other ruins along the way. Here's a prime example right here. Evidence shows that Koba was first settled between 50 BC and 100 AD. When you look around Koba and you see all the dense foliage, you can just imagine how this area must have been overgrown before it was rediscovered. It's estimated that during its peak, Koba had over 50,000 residents. As you're going down the bike trail on your left-hand side, you're going to notice a Mesoamerican ball game court. My understanding is that this ball game was ritualistic in nature and had a lot of violent activity that goes along with it. The main attraction here at Koba is this pyramid that you can climb. I'm not even going to begin to try to pronounce the name of this pyramid, but here it is. The pyramid is 137 feet tall and has 120 steps all the way to the top. This pyramid is the second tallest Mayan pyramid in the world. The pyramid was actually discovered in the 1800s, but it wasn't open to the public until 1973 because the surrounding jungle was way too thick in order to even get to it. So even though it requires a bicycle to get to it, I still highly recommend making the journey to visit this pyramid. It's probably one of the last pyramids in Mexico that you can actually climb. Word of warning about the pyramid, it's much easier to go up than it is to come down. Most people find it easier to kind of scoot down on their butts. Just figure out the most comfortable way for yourself and just get down any way you can. Thank you for joining us on this tour of Koba. If you enjoyed it, please like the video and subscribe to our channel so you can see more content in the future. Thanks for watching.